What's up guys, Crazy VR here. Today I'm bringing you guys a video about what it's like to be a firefighter and a gamer because I actually, believe it or not, do get questions about that. People don't know what it's like. And, um, yeah, so, <laughs> I guess it's, uh, one second, guys. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, I thought I heard something going on downstairs. But anyway, a lot of people ask me questions about it and they don't know what it's like, what takes up more of my time. Um, and it's actually about equal um, between school, firefighting, sleeping, and gaming. Um, that's basically my whole life. And now that I'm working, I guess works in there a little bit too. Um, but, I mean, the way, like, people ask how to balance it and everything, really, it's just. You go to the call if you get a call, and it can be so annoying when you're trying to make a YouTube video like me, and I'll be like in the middle of editing or something like that, and I have to go, um, and especially if the call turns out to be nothing. Um, so it's it, and it's also really annoying like when you get a long call uh, and you're playing with your friends and you get this really long call. Like for example, when I went to my second. Uh, no, my my fourth fire, third or fourth fire, I don't know which one it was, um, it was a seven hour call, and I think I've said something about that, um, I was in the middle of making a video, so I didn't upload the next day, um, and I was also playing with Nate and Gino, and I remember they were probably extremely annoyed with me, um, but it wasn't anything I could prevent, um, Call a call is important to me, um, so I just go whenever I get a call, and it, like I said, it's annoying because like some like the uh, fontages and stuff when I'm editing them, they take hours to edit, and um, it's so annoying to be almost done or right in the middle of it, or like one time I accidentally left the clip playing and I had just split it so I didn't know where to go um, where I wanted if I wanted to cut that out so I had to basically restart from that point and it took like an extra half hour um, and it's annoying um, like the call the call ended up being like nothing so uh, but we were there for a while it was what's called a wires call uh, which is when there's wires down in the street and you really have to wait for the electric company to come. There's nothing you can do. Um, and it, people ask me like, is there ever times where I just say screw it? I don't. Have, I'm not gonna go. That happens a couple times. Not not much. I learned my lesson from doing that. Uh, I missed an accident. What we call a pin, which is when someone's actually it's an accident with entrapment when someone's actually trapped in there. Uh, and the term for when it's an actual fire is a job. Um, so I actually missed a pin, which I'm actually, to this day, I'm still glad I missed because it was a call that I know would have gotten to me. Um, it was two DOAs uh, with dead on arrival. So I'm glad I didn't see anything. Um, and yeah. Uh, so that would have messed me up a little bit. Um, and that was the last time I purposely said I'm not gonna go to a call. Um, and that was right, that was in December right after Christmas. Um, and I still remember that. That, my, the guys at the firehouse were all messed up. I mean, um, but I have a lot of calls for this year. Like, I've made a lot of calls, and, uh, I actually would have made more uh, if my parents are home. That's it's sometimes nice though, like when it's like a fire alarm or something, which usually turns out to be nothing, and my dad's not home or my and my mom's not home or something, and like I I don't have a ride, so I kind of have an excuse to not go. But people want to say, am I ever scared? Um, not really, but I'll tell you one thing. This is what scares the crap out of me when I'm sleeping. And this goes off. That's my pager, and uh, it'll go off sometimes in the middle of the night, and I will literally jump so high and almost hit my ceiling fan. Um, that's literally the scariest thing. So 
Anyway, guys, hope you guys understand what I'm trying to say here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. It'll be down in the description below. As always, guys, this has been Crazy VR. Thank you guys for watching, and have a nice day. See ya.